Hello everyone, how is it going? Welcome back to another video. Alright guys, so uh, yeah, I know in today's video we are going to fight the tier 3 sub-bosses on Realm Clash Heroic 5. And uh, yeah, you know, I'm going to try to take them down. Okay, so let's see. All four of them are still living and breathing. I got to take them down. Now there is this LOA team that I've set up with... Obviously, Gemstone on Arkham Knight Batman. That's what I've been using for a very long time now. And uh, it just uh, gives me enough room to use Raven with other characters. Right? So, uh, yeah. You know, let's proceed. So, in yesterday's video, actually, the game kind of got stuck. So, I actually pre-recorded this until I figured that out. I've played it on the phone itself, you know. Right, there we go. Forty hits. That's nice. Alright, going great at the moment. No issues whatsoever. I don't think uh, it will take long. Just a couple of more stuns. And the uh, green arrow will be dead. There we go. I'm moving on to the next pip. Which is against the... Uh, Black Lightning. Now this, this will be fun because I'm going to use... Uh, yeah, I'm going to use Batum in the Drown with the uh, Kamidogu Dagger. Uh, I've I've basically used this uh, team with Batwoman, uh, Batman who laughs before. Uh, never used this team uh, like this to do this kind of damage. So let's see how far I can take this. I mean the damage. This is just a level five uh, Kami Dogo dagger, not like level seven, level eight, like the other solo raid artifacts that I have. And it's easy to combo interrupt them, so which makes my job even more uh, easy. All right, we're already doing twenty-two million. 25 i've reached more than uh, 30 35 million let's see if we can reach above 40 mil okay there comes the super move and uh, that's the super move tanked by classic wonder woman There we go. Mm. All right, so it's more than 500% damage right now. 600%. Let's see if we can reach 1000%. Is it 1000%? We'll get insanely high damage. We're already doing 39, 40 million. Oh, it's 41, 42, 43, you're right, it's increasing bits by bits. I bet I could reach more than 50 million on 1000%. Yes, definitely I would. All right, that was easy. And that was something uh, <clears throat> that a lot of people can do. Only thing that you need is to have a Kamidogu dagger at a decent level. All right, now moving on to the next pip, it, it's against uh, Flash. Now, boss the Flash is, yeah, he is not that easy again because he is having, he cannot take damage over time. He is resistant to damage over time. He has a cloaked modifier, I think. No, a resilient modifier, I think. So he basically converts all the lethal and critical attacks. As you can see that there is like little shield coming uh, around him. Just like we have the shield for Brainiac in phase two, which means he won't, he won't take any sort of lethal or critical damage, any sort of. Which makes job a lot easier, plus there is no DOT, which means we cannot use our LOA team as well. But let's see how this clip goes. Now, oh, come on. Alright, that was nice. 
Let it get him and keep him in the corner as much as possible because uh, yeah, if my Deathstroke dies pretty quick, then the clones stand no chance in front of him. I mean, he's too fast, you know, too fast to handle the basics. The best way to go now, take a look at that. He's so fast that normally, you know, any other character after he does a special, he has this like a second or two before he recovers. But over here, our boy Flash, he just... It's just too fast, you know. Exactly like his name. Like he should be, you know. I'm trying to tank uh, the super move over here, get the clones in. There we go. That's the first hit from the clone. Let's see if I can get him back in the corner over there. Okay. Thankfully, he's not doing any specials makes it a little easy okay now he all right now the clone's dead first clone did nothing just a few hits all right there we go now we gotta get him back in the corner Nineteen mil. All right, still going strong. Second clone apparently has not been dead yet, and he's dead now. All right, let's see if we have something left. Okay, nope, it's done. Here we go. So, uh, Deathstroke specials can interrupt the opponent's specials. Special 3. That's what I'm using over here now. Here we go. It also increases chance to do crit damage. It's not like he's going to take any crit damage. But that was pip number 2, guys. Uh, pip number 3, guys. So, that was nice. And we did more than 50%. Alright, we did around 70-75% damage over there. Not bad. All right, now we're going to go up uh, with King and Raven, try to finish him off. 334 mil. Raven with Gemstone. Level 5 uh, Dagger on uh, Dr. Fate. And uh, Dark Metal Cards on uh, King of Atlantis Aquaman. All right, let's see if we can finish him off. He's quite, quite irritating. I have to say that. All right, there we go. Two stacks of darkness. Three. You see, he's so fast, he is not allowing characters to tag in and tag out. That's the first special three. You have to be very careful, you know, with your tag-ins and stuff. You want to make sure that you win against this guy. Right, you see? He, look at him. So fast. Alright, so finally landing a good tag in. So his super move is disabled, which means I can still manage to do a few more hits. Oh, come on. Without worrying about the super move. King super move disables the opponent's super move. If you do it for like a minute. Now, this doesn't look like it's going to be enough. You know. Yeah, it's seriously not going to be enough. Okay, there we go. Oh, now you see he's blocked it. So every time you try to tag in like that, you just make sure that you hold block and let him, let your opponent do one hit at least. You know, otherwise you will, you will just be standing there blocking your hits and you won't be able to do anything. Alright, the darkness stacks are gone. Let's hope she does not die. So this, yeah, this won't be enough. 
I may have to use another pip over here. Or maybe another pip after the pips are refreshed. It's just 40 seconds left now and there's just too much damage to take down. Now the super move is active. I've actually, uh, you know, activated the hand gestures over there. Finger uh, gestures so that you know exactly what I'm doing. You know, uh, where I'm tapping, how I'm swiping and stuff like that. Which makes it a little easier to, you know, understand the gameplay, you know. And that was five. I, I could have taken him down, you know. There were some, a lot of uh, things that were messed up. Alright guys, so that was that. Unfortunately, he's not dead yet. Uh, I'll play another pip with him when uh, the pips are fresh. So 182 mil is not enough. It's seriously not enough. All right, now let's take down Deathstroke with our main guy, Beast Boy. And uh, we're going to go with the usual set of team and the usual set of artifacts that we use. Hey, there we go. And the damage starts now. I really love this team, you know, because it helps you to trigger Zatanna's puppet so quickly, you know. And it doesn't go away that easily. Alright, there we go. And that's the super move. I did it like in the first 30 seconds because I didn't want to waste time. There we go. 38 hits. It's not bad at all. Now let's see how much damage will increase. Are we going till 15 mil, 20 mil? Let me go with that. Could have gone more than 20 mil if it did like 40 hits, but I guess that's enough. I mean, look at the serious damage we are doing right now. Alright, it's gone. Uh, the combo meter is gone, but it's enough, man. I mean, take a look at the damage. Alright, guys. So, uh, yeah, I mean, Beast Boy is always great to play with. And as you can see. So, guys, I guess that's pretty much it for the video today. If you've enjoyed it, give it a like and let's meet again in the next video. Until then, guys, have a great day. Take care and have a good one, guys. Bye-bye.